Levi, Jacob, everyone come. Your father wishes to speak to you. I have seen a vision in which I know that Jerusalem is destroyed. And had we remained in Jerusalem, we should also have perished. Notwithstanding our afflictions, we have obtained a land of promise, a land which is choice above all other lands. Wherefore, this land is consecrated unto him whom the Lord shall bring. And if they shall keep his commandments, they shall be blessed upon the face of this land. But behold, when the time cometh that they shall dwindle in unbelief, after they have received so great blessings from the hand of the Lord, if the day shall come that they will reject the Holy One of Israel, the true Messiah, their Redeemer and their God, behold the judgments of him that is just shall rest upon them. Awake, and arise from the dust, and hear the words of a trembling parent. My heart hath been weighed down with sorrow, for I have feared lest for the hardness of your hearts that the Lord your God should come out in the fullness of his wrath upon you, that ye be cut off and destroyed forever. Rebel no more against your brother, whose views have been glorious, and who hath been an instrument in the hands of God, and bringing us forth into the land of promise. For were it not for him, we must have perished with hunger in the wilderness. Nevertheless, ye sought to take away his life. Yea, and he hath suffered much sorrow because of you. But if ye will not hearken unto him, I take away my first blessing, and it shall rest upon him. 